Okay, girls, here is the second card. And this one is also using the Foils uh, Designer Series paper that is available for free in the second release celebration catalog with a $50 purchase. You can pick that one as your free, free item. And so I'm gonna start out with a piece of the silver and white foil design. It's a cute little flower design. And uh, I'm gonna use the um, makeup brush, but you girls, if you don't have a makeup brush, you can use your sponges. <clears throat> This is Pretty Peacock uh, ink, and the paper for the card, or the uh, cardstock, is um, Pretty Peacock. So, I'm going to start <coughs> doing, I, I think I want to do this ombre look. So, I'm starting at one end, and then just going up all the way up. I'm going in a circular motion. All the way to the end so of course it's going to be much lighter at the other end as opposed to where you started so I'm going to ink it up again start down at the bottom again go over the same part because I want that to be darker and then again you're just going to go up all the way to the top of the page for paper page and then that would be up to you how dark you want this to be how dark you want your darkest part so again I'm just taking it in a circular motion going over what I've already done we're gonna do that several times <clears throat> ink it up again And then you do get inky with this. Sorry. <laughs> and especially when I have it on my fingers like that piece right there. Try not to wrinkle. That's because I'm, I rub pretty hard. And you might get a wrinkle. Just be careful not to do that. <laughs> like I did. Start down at the bottom again. ink here. But I do want it to be a light blue shade up here. Now this one, still I've done it quite a bit darker, so let's do another bit on here. go <clears throat> one more time load it up okay now I don't know if you can tell or not but it's kind of covering the pretty foil so I'm gonna get a tissue and I'm just gonna rub this off See how it picks that up off of the foil part because I still want my silver to shine. So I'm just gonna do that. Like that. Okay. Now I'm gonna throw that away. Then I'm gonna take this piece and I'm going to adhere it to the first layer with Tombow. Yep. Like that. And then I'm going to use the pretty, um, this is the metallic edge ribbon. This one is the white with the silver. And I'm going to place that over that little smudgy piece. <laughs> We'll hide that right there. 
and then I'm just going to glue that to the back. Like that. Like that. There we go. And then I'm going to apply that to my card base, which I already have folded and used my bone folder to get a nice crisp edge. And then I'm going to go ahead and put my Tombow on my card piece. And then I want the darkest at the bottom. And then I'm just going to put that on there like that. Okay. Now I used my punch. And I don't remember what this one's called, but it's a cute punch. And then I'm going to take thinking of you with all my heart and that is from the peaceful moments stamp set thinking of you with all my heart and then on the inside I'm gonna put thank you so I'm gonna ink that up with the pretty peacock and stamp it on there like that and then I'm gonna pop that up with dimensionals Pull the backs off. Sure. <laughs> like that. And then I'm just going to pop that on there. Right in the center. Like that. It's a little crooked. And then what I did was I had like an extra piece of the DSP. And so I just cut out like the flower shape and I did two of those so I'm gonna put those like that what would be cute too if you wanted to instead of just having them white you could add a little blue tint to them if you wanted to peacock teal here just a smidgey Then <clears throat> I'm going to take a couple more dimensionals and put one on the back of each flower. Oh, that's kind of cute. I like that light color on there. I think I like that better than just the white. Hmm. There. And then if you want, you can kind of curl your ends up a little bit. Like that. And then I'm going to take my clear faceted gems and I'm going to put a couple of the medium sized ones. I'm going to put one in each flower. Got to make sure you get the stick them behind it or else it won't stick. And then I'm going to take a few smaller ones and just kind of put here and there just for interest. I don't want that one there. This one over here. There we go. So there's the front. Cute. Then on the inside, being the teal, or pretty peacock, I call it teal. I'm going to take a piece of white cardstock, cut it four and a quarter by, no, four by five and a quarter. And I'm going to stamp the thank you. Right there. And then this cute little like corner piece is from a new stamp set that I can't tell you about yet, <laughs> but I will really soon. It's gonna be released um, next month and it's gonna be um, really cute. So anyway, there's that. And so then I'm just gonna take that piece and put my combo on it and put it on the inside 
and there's your card. And here's the other card. So, there you have it. Have fun. Bye.